project would not have been happened without the support of our city leaders, namely Mayor Michael Miller, and in particular, Council President Darrell Clark. <laughs> Darrell was instrumental in helping us acquire the land for the center, so thank you, Darrell, for all your support. For, for the groundbreaking ceremony, I just want to say how important and significant it is to have a, a facility that's going to be proactive in dealing with some of the health challenges in this neighborhood. The mayor has indicated earlier about some of the statistics and about this particular community government reference and need to deal with some of those needs. And I want to say uh, it is really a wonderful thing that Jefferson and Steve spearheading this is an initiative to get things done. Uh, the military is being a significant part, again, uh, for a wonderful development and, and how important this means to the neighborhood, not just in the actual building itself and not actually as it relates to the service that, that will be provided, but the symbolism associated with investment in this neighborhood makes people in this community understand that uh, people do care about this community. Uh, as I talk to my friends and residents, and I, you know, I happen to be fortunate enough to grow up in this community, we understood what this used to be. Right? Uh, this used to be Cecil B. Moore was the block that you wanted to be. Right? I mean, it was all of the things happened to Cecil B. Moore. And through a series of time, some unfortunate things happened. But now we're bringing it back. Um, we're going to bring it to a level and surpass that level than what it was. So to all of the partners, probably home, all of your partners and friends, Governor Moore, I want to thank you, Governor Thomas, Calvin. Brian, all you folks, I'm just going to miss some names and get in trouble. But I just want to thank you all so much. Uh, I'm just so excited about what we've done today. So again, uh, Mary, uh, thank you for your wonderful work. Keep up the work. Um, we will be awaiting your next request. <laughs> This is going to be a wonderful facility uh, for all the residents. It's going to be the cornerstone of providing opportunities to stay healthy. Uh, it's a proactive, preventive type of uh, process, and I'm, I'm really excited.